Hey, listen up. It looks like the Scarlet Witch solo movie probably won't be hitting theaters until after Avengers Secret Wars. Yeah, I won't lie. I'm pretty bummed about that. But honestly, I think this extra time could make Wanda Maximoff's solo project even more epic when it finally happens. Now, before you get too upset, hold on. Let's break it down and figure out what Marvel Studios is really planning here. There's been a lot of reshuffling going on, especially after Robert Downey Jr. returned to play Doctor Doom. That move alone seems to have changed the whole game for the MCU's movie and series schedule. But before we get into all that, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that button. We're diving into Marvel news, updates, and theories like this every day. And I know you don't want to miss out. So subscribe and give us a thumbs up if you're ready to stay in the loop. All right, let's jump into it. I am. Let's start with the good news. The MCU seems to be finally getting its act together when it comes to planning out the storylines and projects for the multiverse saga. And honestly, this is a huge deal. It's exactly what we need to make sure that every movie and series they drop really hits the mark. Meeting fan expectations, tying characters and stories together, and hopefully bringing back that golden era of the MCU we had with the Infinity Saga. Personally, I think this is a smart move. I've missed the days when the MCU was known for its solid storytelling, great character development, and smooth continuity. Things that have felt a bit lacking lately, right? Some of the recent projects have felt disconnected, like they're in different universes entirely. Plus, with so many projects coming out back to back, it's easy for fans to feel overwhelmed, like they can't keep up with every movie or series. Now, here's what you need to remember. To pull off this new plan, Marvel Studios definitely has to prioritize certain projects based on how important they are to the story, the overall continuity, and how they'll build toward the two big finale films, Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars. But here's where the bad news kicks in. To make all this work, some projects are going to get shuffled around. That means a few will get delayed, and some might even get canceled altogether. Now, let's focus on the Scarlet Witch solo movie. It's a project that definitely deserves to be at the top of Marvel Studios' priority list. But lately, rumors and insider reports suggest that the Scarlet Witch solo movie might be pushed to after Avengers Secret Wars. I know, I know. A lot of you are probably feeling pretty bummed out hearing that. Scarlet Witch is one of the most loved MCU characters right now, especially from the ones we still have around. She's got that deep connection to the original Avengers, and let's not forget, she played a major role throughout the Infinity Saga. And come on, we all know how powerful she is. Who wouldn't want to see Elizabeth Olsen crushing it as Wanda Maximoff again? It's no secret that Marvel Studios has been dropping a bunch of hints that Scarlet Witch will return. You can spot them in a few movies and shows here and there. So why delay her solo movie? Before you get too bummed out, let me drop this little piece of info. All the insiders are still saying that Wanda Maximoff is going to play a massive role in Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars. So just because the Scarlet Witch solo movie might not hit theaters before Secret Wars, that doesn't mean we're not going to see Wanda at all. In fact, her role is actually expected to be even bigger. Look, we have to face the fact that Scarlet Witch has become one of the most important characters in the MCU. She's not just some side character anymore. She's front and center, and the fandom loves her. And with Agatha All Along airing on Disney Plus right now, it's clear that fans can't stop talking about her, especially since her kids, Billy and Tommy, are playing major roles in the series. It's not just one or two projects tied to her either. Marvel's got a lot lined up for Wanda's storyline. We've got Agatha All Along, Vision Quest, and there's even a rumor about a spin-off focused on finding Tommy Maximoff. That's a lot of Scarlet Witch content coming down the pipeline. Now, if you're thinking about the biggest faces in the MCU right now, Scarlet Witch is definitely in that top tier, right alongside characters like Doctor Strange and Spider-Man. Marvel knows this, and they've got plans to keep Wanda in the spotlight for years to come. We already know there are three spin-offs and one solo movie in the works for Scarlet Witch. That's a huge investment in her character. So even though the solo movie might be delayed until after Secret Wars, that's not necessarily a bad thing. In fact, I think it's a good thing. It gives Marvel more time to develop her story and build anticipation. Plus, we're still going to see her in other projects, so it's not like we're missing out. And it's not just Scarlet Witch feeling the effects of Marvel's reshuffle. According to one insider, Alex Perez, projects like Nova and Midnight Suns are going to face the same fate. 
they're being pushed back too. So it's not like Wanda's solo movie is being singled out here. Recently on Twitter, MCU Film News posted that Marvel Studios is actively working on Spider-Man 4. But there's a bit of a challenge when it comes to fitting Tom Holland's Spidey into the bigger storyline. And guess what? That might mean Spider-Man 4 could also get its release date tweaked. What we're seeing here is a big recalibration of the MCU's future. Marvel seems to be taking the time to make sure every piece of the puzzle fits perfectly. And if that means waiting a little longer for these projects, then maybe it's for the best. So why is Marvel Studios delaying so many movie releases right now? I get that question a lot. And to be honest, it's frustrating, but there's a reason for it. Let me explain. I'll point you to a tweet from one of the insiders, Alex Perez. He basically said that the biggest reason why all these highly anticipated projects like Scarlet Witch and Nova are getting pushed back is because Marvel Studios wants to really focus on the multiverse saga. And honestly, that makes sense. They're trying to weave this super complex storyline involving different timelines, alternate universes, and of course, all the craziness with King, Doctor Doom, and the rest. And because of that, they're putting these other projects on the back burner for the time being. It's all about priorities. But here's the good news for all you Scarlet Witch fans, and trust me, I'm right there with you. Wanda's situation is a bit different. Even though her solo movie might get delayed, it's not like Marvel is just gonna bench her until Secret Wars. Actually, it's the opposite. I mean, come on, everybody already knows who Scarlet Witch is. She's not some new character that Marvel needs to introduce and hope fans connect with. We've been through her entire arc, from Age of Ultron to WandaVision. So even without her solo movie dropping soon, Marvel can still slide Wanda into all these other multiverse saga projects. The fan base is already attached to her. And honestly, it's safe to say she's probably the most beloved character in the MCU right now, at least among the ones who are still sticking around. And we're already seeing that happen. Like in Agatha all along, we keep hearing Scarlet Witch's name pop up in the storyline. Plus, her kids, Tommy and Billy, are a big part of that series, which makes sense because they're her sons from WandaVision. And on top of that, we've got spin-offs coming, not just for Agatha, but for Vision Quest as well. All of these stories are connected to Wanda. And if we're being real, they're building toward one big payoff, the return of the Scarlet Witch. There's no way Marvel is ignoring her importance. They're basically stacking up all these spin-offs to make her return even more meaningful when it finally happens. Plus, when you think about it, Scarlet Witch is one of the few characters that's totally tied to the multiverse saga. Besides Doctor Strange and maybe America Chavez, Wanda is the character you think of when you talk about multiverses in the MCU. So yeah, it's all connected and it's only a matter of time before we see her back in action in a big way. And speaking of big things in the I'm works, sorry. let's not forget Spider-Man 4. It's been confirmed that Marvel and Sony are working on it, but the big challenge is figuring out where they wanna take Spidey's story next. Are we gonna see him more in street level stuff? Or is he gonna get roped into the bigger multiverse storyline? There are so many possibilities, especially with the whole multiverse thing expanding and Null being teased in Venom The Last Dance. There are a lot of moving parts, but one thing's for sure, Spider-Man 4 could end up playing a massive role in all of this. Anyway, that's the latest update on the Scarlet Witch solo movie and the bigger picture with Marvel Studios. How are you guys feeling about it? Are you bummed out that her solo movie might not come out until after Secret Wars? Or are you just hyped that she's gonna have such a huge role in the MCU going forward? Let me know what you think in the comments. And hey, if you've made it this far in the video, you're obviously a true MCU fan. Okie dokie, artichokey. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future updates. I'm planning to keep the content coming every day and I'd love for you to join in on all the MCU discussions with me. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.